Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you find yourself in the Windows 11 Insider program and you have been experiencing higher than normal CPU usage uh, in Windows 11 um, lately, then just to let you know that um, apparently you're not alone and there are quite a lot of complaints um, of late from insiders who are saying that they have seen an increase in CPU usage, apparently linked to the cross-device service where the cross-device service is using a lot more um, CPU than it should be. And just a quick recap, um, your cross-device service is part of your cross-device experience host, which um, is a host that brings your Windows PC and mobile device together. And it's linked and part of the mobile devices on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So if we head over to Bluetooth and devices, mobile devices, Basically, at the end of the day, what it does is it is a service that allows your PC to sync with your smartphone for file and media sharing. And Microsoft has uh, been working on adding new features to uh, this feature over the last while in recent updates. And apparently, the cross-device service uh, is apparently at fault, according to reports doing the rounds online. So if you have been experiencing higher than normal CPU usage on Windows 11, that could be the reason why. Now at this stage, um, it's not exactly clear why this is a problem in the Insider program, because obviously in the Insider program, uh, you can expect to see a couple of bugs because the builds are in preview. So um, obviously there are bugs that are expected and a bit of instability, but this apparently has been going on now for quite some time and is not um, disappearing. But the so-called good news is that um, about a week ago, um, Microsoft have said, and I'm quoting, that they've identified the cause and are working on a fix. Now, as mentioned, that was a week ago. So it is worth, worth noting that that response on the feedback hub by Microsoft was posted a week ago. So we are still waiting for a fix. But nonetheless, um, that is the problem apparently um, due to reports doing the rounds online that the cross-device experience host, the service, is sparking a little bit um, and it's causing higher than normal CPU usage and sparking in CPU usage. So obviously, um, we hope that Microsoft does roll out a fix uh, sooner than later if you do find yourself in the Insider program. And this has been doing quite a lot of, um, there's been quite a lot of reports doing the rounds online. So I just wanted to put it out there because I do know that some of you are insiders who view this channel. And if you have been experiencing experiencing that issue just to keep you posted and in the loop and if this does get resolved obviously i'll keep you guys posted so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one